We'll guide you through how to transfer photos and videos from your Samsung phone to your Mac. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. To go and do this, we're going to be utilizing Google Drive, which is basically a cloud storage platform and file sharing platform. So all we need to do is go and open up the Google Drive app. You probably have it on your phone already. If you don't, you can always download it from the Play Store. Then all you need to do is you want to make sure you note the Google account you're currently using as we'll need to use the same one on our computer. I'll guide you through that. Then go to the bottom right and click on files and go and click on new and go and create folder. And I'm just gonna go and name this Samsung. This just helps keeps all of our photos and videos together and you can then go and click on it. Then click on new in the bottom right and click on upload. And at the top here, you can go and select gallery. And now you can go and select what you want to go and transfer. So you can go and select quite a few as you can see. And once you're happy, you can go and press done in the top right. They'll then go and start downloading and you can go and wait. Now that they've finished, we can now go onto our Mac. On your Mac, go and open up a web browser. I'll just go and use Chrome, but you could use Safari. And then all you wanna do is go and search for Drive or Google Drive and go to this Drive website. Now here we are on Drive. So if you need to sign in, make sure you sign into the same account as you were on your Samsung phone. Or if you need to switch account, you can do this in the top right and you can sign in up there as well. So click on that icon. Then click on my drive on the left and we can find the folder we created called Samsung. And here it is. What I can then do is click on the folder name at the top, click on download and it will then download the entire folder. Here we are in my downloads folder and here's the file. We can then go and double click on it and I can unzip it. And we can then go in here and here are the photos and videos. 